Would you would you be able to do a miniature prayer with me right now? Do you think just just for old time's sake to remind me of the uh, good old days? Sir, we I, I would get in trouble if I did that, and I would lose my. You would job, get in trouble so for I prayer. Joel Osteen's Lakewood Church got a four point four million dollars. What? Four point four million in federal PPP loans. Holy shit! As federal lawmakers mull another COVID-19 stimulus package, some groups are calling for more oversight for religious institutions that receive taxpayer money to shoulder the payroll and other costs during the pandemic. Some point to the multi-million dollar loan received by large religious institutions and churches, including Joel Osteen's Lakewood Church. My word. Well. Hmm. Oh, wow. They have a Canadian number. What do you think, folks? Should I should I do the Canadian number or the American number? Eh, eh, ¿por qué no los dos? We can do both. ¿Por qué no los dos? I'll start with, uh, I'll start with Canada. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call as a humble little, a wee little Canadian. Thank you for calling Joel Osteen Ministries. Please listen to all of our options as our selections have recently changed. If you are calling to order a resource, make a donation, or if you need ministry information, please press 1. To speak with a member of our prayer team, please press 2. To update your account information or to check on the status of an existing order, please press 3. Hi, this is Joel. Victoria and I want to... Thank you for calling Joel Osteen Ministries. This call may be recorded for training purposes. My name is Leonard Anthony. Are you calling for prayer today? Uh, I am. Thank you so much for taking my call. How's your day going? It's going pretty good. How about yours? I think it's about to go way better if you're asking me. All right. Great. I'd be happy to take your prayer request so we can pray for your needs. To better serve you, can I have the spelling of your first and last name? Yeah, it's M-I-K-E. That's Mike. And my last name is Chairman. And that's uh, spelled chair like uh, the thing you would, uh, you know, settle down on if you've had a long, hard day at work or you've uh, received some federal funding, that kind of stuff. Uh, and then man, M-A-N. So Mike Chairman. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Mrs. Chairman, what would you like to pray over? Uh, so I just read an article that Joe Olstein apparently just got $4.4 million in federal PPP loans. And I'm going to be frank. I want to see that raised all the way to 10. So I want to pray that Joel Osteen's Lakewood Church can get $10 million in federal PPP loans because that and only that will allow him to live in the splendor that I believe God has decreed upon him. Hey, PPP loans? Uh, yeah, PPP loans. So he's, he's already got 4.4. I want to increase that to 10 million. Can we do that right now? Yes, sir. Sure, I'm, I got that down. Uh, is there anything else you want to pray over, Mr. Chairman? That's That alone would make me happy. All right, Mr. Chairman, thank you for sharing your prayer request with me today. Would you like to provide a cell phone number to receive ministry updates? Uh, no, I'd just like to receive the prayer. Okay, uh, we don't actually pray on this line. Uh, what we do is we uh, notate the prayer. We send it into the prayer team. They receive it the very next business day, and they pray over it for 30 days. Oh, would you would you be able to do a miniature prayer with me right now? Do you think just just for old time's sake to remind me of the uh, good old days? Sir, we I, I would get in trouble if I did that, and I would lose my job. You would job, get in trouble so for I, prayer. I really oh, I don't want no. Okay, I don't want uh -huh. you to get in trouble. I definitely don't want you to get in trouble. But shame on them putting getting people in trouble for prayer. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> they they want to handle the prayers themselves, so Fair it's enough. not. It's not something. It's out of my hands. I do apologize. No, no. I appreciate it. Hey, uh, look out for yourself, and I think you should have a blessed day. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for calling Joel Osteen Ministries. You have a blessed day as well. You too. What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. No, no. no. He's, he's praying over there. What? He's praying on company time? On company time? He's praying. Get him. Get him. Get him. Take him down. Get him. Tackle him. Get that motherfucker. He's praying. He's praying. Get God out of this church. God has no place within these sacred walls. You fiend. The hell kind of prayer line is that? So, okay. So, if if I'm not mistaken, here's, here's how the whole system works. He's going to take my prayer for, for Joel Osteen to get $10 million and for the next month, a whole bunch of people who I'm guessing are paid minimum wage have to sit there all day being like, okay, and now prayer number 602-116-2554 for Mr. Mike Chairman. Now we'd like to hold hands and pray so Joel Olstein's Lakewood Church gets $10 million in PPP loans. Thank you. And in your name, we pray. Okay, now on to prayer number 244. And that's all they do for a month straight. Wow.
Wow. The scams. You should what do you think? Do you do you think we should try the the American just make experiment? I don't know. I think actually that was good enough. I don't I don't want to bug people at work. I don't want to bug people at work. <laughs> Poor guy was just doing his job. He could, I could have got him fired. I could have got him fired for trying to for trying to prayer. God damn. Hey, what's up? My name is Joey, but you can call me Jola. I'm a 20-year-old progressive commentator here on YouTube who is planning to run for state senate in 2022 at the ripe age of 22 in my home state of Pennsylvania, while at the same time completing my master's degree. It's a full plate a little bit, especially considering I'm from one of the most conservative districts in the United States, and I will be running against, I think, a 20-year incumbent Republican, but I think I have a way to break through. To join me on this journey, please check out out my YouTube channel. Any support here helps me in real life, obviously. Um, and I will be documenting this entire experience, you know, from the bottom up, building the campaign, getting some type of volunteers, going door to door, what kind of outreach to do during this pandemic, and how to be a progressive in a really conservative area, how to win back the Rust Belt. I will be talking about that as well as regular content in general. Yeah, so thank you all. What lies around the corner? Never knowing who's going to kill you. Are you the next one to be murked? You never know if it's a friend or a foe. If you want to see the biggest names in BreadTube and Left Twitch and Butter Thing and I don't know the fucking names anymore, come see Left Among Us. If you want us to advertise your channel or work, please go to wearesurfs.com and email us a 20 to 30 second ad and we'll take it on to the end of one of our videos to help promote your leftist channel or progressive something. Whatever you do. To our god, I'm Rast, Xander Corvus, and Schlatsky. We shall commit blood sacrifices in your honor. To our monarch, Tom Spiker, our lives are yours to command. To our lords, Jeffrey Lamb, Trevor R., Stephen, Hans Josephin, Poppy Nelson, Ryan Lubin, Jimothy K. Meeblebeeps Jr., we bow meekly for your pleasure. To our knights of the round table, Josh Mickelson, Dylan Byth, Zach Christensen, Todd Buckingham, Todd Lajeunesse, Political Puppy, Jimmy Big Nuts, Andreas Chitoro, Good Poon Hates Cops, That's Solid Poon Then, Dr. Zayas, Yopi, Violent Orchard, Sophie Baby, Jack Darko, Thomas Barrington, Jay Fraser Cartwright, Goofalankius, Melissa Murphy, Nicholas Marks, Alexander Thaler, Ali Rada Jaffer, Alex Gauvin, Radical Maniac, We Salute You.